Yeah, that body's a blessing, girl. I ain't trying to pressure her. Hey guys, what's going on? Nick C here from the Sticky Socks, and welcome to today's video. So, as of today, we have finally received the weekly update after the Christmas, and it's announcing the new February event. So, what is the February event? It's going to be called the Crimson Days. And what Bungie have said is this February, in the world of the real, loving couples will descend upon crowded restaurants to exchange gifts and glance deeply into each other's fluttered eyes. In the world of Destiny, the Guardians will be celebrating the very rare variety of companionship that can only be found in the heat of battle. You're invited to the tower to partake in the real party, a ritual known by the brave as Crimson Days. This will be starting on February the 9th for one week, and obviously this is to celebrate Valentine's Day. And they said, along with the other improvement and fixes, to very small things that no one really needs to know, just quest fixes and other stuff, they're delivering a brand new 2v2 crucible mode called Crimson Doubles. Now, we have absolutely no idea what this is going to be. I think it could be a reference to uh, the sword kind of uh, battles, 2v2, just swords only thing. Because we did see medals in Taken King kind of data mine stuff that showed off medals for getting sword kills or capturing the crim sword or we don't know. We don't know yet. And there will be some loot from this from Crucible and so on. So that's just all speculation. We'll know February 9th and I'm really looking forward to it. It's a new Crucible experience and no one can say no to that really. Next up in the update, they showed off that Iron Banner will be coming back next week on Tuesday, as usual, and the game mode is Rift this time instead. The guns that will be on offer is the Fusion Rifle and the Scout Rifle. And then towards Armor, it will be the Chess Piece and the Leg Pieces. They also announced that they are doing new things with the matchmaking system and doing a bit of an overhaul with it, because at the moment it's skill-based, but they're not saying it's accurate enough or whatever, so they're fixing that too. So anyway guys, that's all in this week's Bungie's update. Sadly, there's no mention of any big DLC or anything substantial, but look, it's something to look forward to. Anyway guys, if you did enjoy the video, please drop a like and subscribe and stay sticky people.